Hey everyone, it's Kristen Burt with Red Carpet Report. Today we're in Pasadena, California to get the inside scoop on all of NBC Universal's summer shows. All right, since your show Rush hasn't debuted just yet, yeah. what can viewers expect from the show? So they can expect a, a medical show that is probably unlike any other me medical show that's been on or is on. Um, there is a medical element to it, obviously he's a, he's a doctor that, um, that will treat anybody for cash. But it's more of a serialized um, story to do with his life and how he struggles with keeping that medical element going whilst um, his inner demons that he sort of fights with uh, heavy medication. Ah, so he's treating people, but he's also sort of treating himself. Himself, one for the patient, one for me. <laughs> <laughs> what has surprised you most about working on the series? Um, I think we're, uh, so far it's been the collaborative nature of it. Actually, you know, Jonathan Levine, who created it, is is a great, great writer and director. But he was so open to my input into it as well. So we 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 improvised a lot as well, which was which was really freeing and something I've never experienced doing before on TV. So yeah. I know as an actor that's always sort of a, it's a gift when you're yeah, able to do that. It's a real gift, yeah. And I, I mean, the script as a whole, when I first got the script, I was like, this is a gift. And I would absolutely love to do this part. So when it actually happened, I was like, amazing. Now, does this make you think of medical care in, in a new way? Because it's a kind of a modern approach of like, you're rich, you've got the cash, you can have the doctor come to you. Yeah, it's that kind of thing. I mean, it's the, I suppose it's, I'm, I'm from the UK, if you can't tell. Um, <laughs> but uh, it's the antithesis of the NHS. So, like, you know, if someone is prepared to pay enough money, then, um, then I'll treat them. Um, but, again, also I will overlook the sort of moral situation and moral ambiguity of that particular case. So, um, and I think he fights that a lot with his own conscience. He thinks that money can buy anything, but actually it doesn't buy his own peace. Ah, oh, interesting. All right, so we have to look forward to this in June, right? Uh, I think so. I don't think we've announced an air date for yet. We don't have an air date. Mm, all right. I'm going to watch it in June. I'm, I'm going to watch it in I'm June. I'm going to watch it at yours. <laughs> at my house. Like, clearly, I have a screener or something. <laughs> Thanks so much. No worries. Nice to meet you. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked what you saw here today, be sure to like us, friend us, tweet us, or comment below. I'm Kristen Burt. We'll see you next time.